Welcome back team, you're gaming with the Colonel and this is Strategic Command WW2 World at War. It is our continuing multiplayer game versus Old Crow Balthazar. Also happens to be one of our first run throughs on with the Allies, uh, along with its sister game. So, what we saw last time was it looks like Paris is going to go down this turn. Right, so we're going to, that's going to be a problem. Hopefully we do a little bit of damage to him before it happens. Now it looks like Paris is going to go down hard. Oh goodness. So he was actually searching to see where he could land. That's what's going on there. He's got some paratroopers somewhere trying to figure out where he can land. That's what that was about. That was the... Uh, <laughs> that was definitely all about him trying to uh, take out, find if there's a weak spot over there that he can land in. Uh-oh. So he took it. Question is, can I take it back? Or do they surrender? He's going for the experience now that he has it, killing as many units as possible. Hurt him. Nope. Yeah, he's just going for some experience at the moment. So the more units that are left, each one of them times 3%. Uh, will allow whether or not the uh, whether or not there's a surrender or not, which is why he's trying to off as many units as possible right now. Like Metz is going to hold to the end. Yeah, it looks like Nancy goes away. For experience at this point. Cherbourg. Okay, let's uh let's let's go. Oh, he's trying to get out. I'm gonna have to go and smoke those guys. Okay, where'd they go? Where did they go? That was a long turn for the Germans there on the uh on the Western Front. Looks like there's a lot of movement where we're not seeing anything. He's doing a lot of, there's a lot of pain going on here right now. And another core is going to die. <laughs> Luckily, he wasn't able to move in. Scouting out everywhere. He's bringing more. I'm concerned about India. I 
All right, replay is finished. Let's um, let's find out here. Lots of stuff was destroyed. Did they surrender? That is the cap capture of Paris. France surrenders. Yep. Okay, France is gone. Um, Third Republic is abolished. There is okay. So there is Vichy. He did not say no. We need to finish him off completely. Although he probably could have. <clears throat> For as long as they hold all of the following locations, which they do, I must have three or more units within 10 hexes of Birmingham. Okay, I did not know that. That's good to know. French government signed an armistice. Supporting the free French will cost us 30. Yeah, we're going to we're going to support them. Yes. And free French seize power here. The triumphant is given to the free French Navy. Oh, we got a French unit. Look at that. All right, and we got two. We got a core in Halifax. Look at that. That guy can come on over sometime soon. And uh, this guy here. is going to wait. Cancel. You force march your way to... Oh no, hold on. I do want to move this guy south. Looks like they're staying, so I'm going to be able to build these guys back up shortly. Alright, so take a look at research real quick for the British. Submarine warfare is almost there. We have nothing going on here. What we really want is M2 weapons too. That would take most of our money, however. <laughs> All right, French are gone. Completely. We do have this problem over here. This guy immediately needs to upgrade. Okay, all the Frenchies are gone, which is terrible. Oh, but we do have the value. Oh, that's a UK. Okay. All right. So let's pull up here again. See if he's still in there. Actually, we'll pull up with this guy. Yeah, this guy. Let's destroy him real quick. All right, so there's that. That's done. Now, <clears throat> I think we need to head north. The Italians are going to give me fits. Italians are going to give me fits. Okay, looks like we got a special forces unit here in Rhodesia. What are we going to do with them? Looks like he's moving in there. I guess we can bombard him, see what's up, right? That's okay. I got I got escorts. Oh wow, one to two. That's that's oh come on. Oh, I lost four factors. Okay, he's definitely gonna be coming in that direction. So You need to upgrade real quick. Uh, 
and then you need to move south in a hurry. Oh, this is going to be bad. Why did that? Why was that that way? You, I'm going to upgrade you for sure. It'll be a bit better. So the question is, is do I try to control the med or do I not? force you. I'll take uh, the money away from stuff that I need, but I think I need to do it. Well, this is not looking all that good. Need more aircraft. Let's hold off on that. I'd really like to find out. There's a submarine. Okay. How many moving points do I have left? Four. One, two, three, four. Unfortunately, I'm in hide mode. Didn't want to be in hide mode. To fix that for next time. So you come over here and schwack that guy. Let's see what else do I got that can go. You come on over here, you come on over here, you come on back to port. You reinforce. You reinforce. You become a raider. You don't move very far. All these guys need upgrades. It's terrible. <sighs> yeah, you're not going to go anywhere until you get upgraded at least with infantry weapons. You need a port to sit in. Can't make it there. So you go there. You go here. Expensive. Expensive. That one I think is 15 for that upgrade.
Tell you what, we're spending all our money here. Every single last penny. Which is probably not good. You can move there. Might as well move up one. And then we'll come back this way. <laughs> Threaten that that way. He's coming back here. I get that. That's fine. What are we going to do over here? I need another unit. So that'll work. And these guys can get over here as rapidly as possible. That would be good. Or maybe come back down into here. Probably hold over there for a while. Okay. So the Americans are doing what? The Brits. I just don't have the money for them. Okay. So the Americans are going to look at research first. They like air defense. These are all twos, so that's good. I, I do need to go after probably command and control, infantry warfare. I need all of this stuff here. So um, I have 100 up to 200. Let's get the long pole in the tent first. And then I'm going to have no money left. So let's go ahead and put this guy here. Do I have anybody on the water? No. Okay, we'll go ahead and uh, reinforce this guy a point. What can we upgrade here? says it's available for upgrade, but I guess I can't do it. It costs too much. So the only other thing I can do is, nope, can't even do that. All right, so I think we're done with the Americans. Soviets. Um, we need to research infantry weapons too. We don't have enough money. Um, you... Gonna go here. You're gonna go here. You're doing your thing. All right, let's see what we got for movement here. Okay, I don't like this at all because Old Crow <clears throat> has got the fins back on his side again. So Finland is now plus eight. Ay, yeah, yeah. He's going to be coming for me soon. I don't want to lose Leningrad for sure. And he may be trying to jump somebody up here into Archangel as well. I'm curious. Can somebody be operated into there? They can. Okay. So there's that. So it might be one of those where you protect here, here, and here in the future. 
So I think you're going to come up to Novograd and be prepared. I think you're going to be a reserve guy. Okay. You're going to move south. You're definitely moving south. You need to be on the Black Sea somewhere. <clears throat> Although having them up here, and busting in behind wouldn't be bad. So it all depends on whether or not he transports German units here. If he transports German units up here, then I've got to go out and defend Murmansk and Archangel. Okay, you're doing your job. Next time, this will be good. I can move him forward. This is also a marsh, so that one's next. Then I'm going to have to fort up Leningrad here. Hmm. Probably have to put a fort there. I don't think I can put a fort on the city, but if I can, I'll try it. And then after this one is done here, he's got to come back and start forting up Moscow. <clears throat> All right. So I think we're done with the Soviets. The Chinese. The Chinese. Let's go take a look at uh, researches. Good. I do want to get the second one of these. I could pay for it, but I need more units, I think, at the moment. Purchase. What can I buy? Okay. There is nothing currently dead all the way. And I do have an army coming in. I have two armies here. All right, so this guy here needs to move somewhere. Get out of the way. Actually, I can get that guy in there, but why? Let's hide this for a second. I could give him that hex. Do I want to do that? He's got to come back here. So that's a for sure thing. And that guy really wants to move there. I'm going to pull him back. The question is, is, do I want to move in there without upgrading? I can only move one hex to there. Yeah, I think I'm going to move him here. This guy's going to come back. Can he do a thing there? That's the question. A fort there. I don't know if you can do it on the mines or not. Let's go find out. No, you cannot. So that's unfortunate.
So, so I'm debating whether or not to uh, upgrade some units or to go ahead and start on the, I, can, I guess I can't. I gotta go ahead and upgrade some units. Okay, so you, go ahead and take your upgrade. We'll work on infantry warfare next time. Okay. Twenty-three each. This one would be even more. Okay. You're an army that needs reinforcing. None of these, this guy, none of these guys can get upgraded. He can get reinforced, though. He can take an upgrade, which I should do. And I don't have enough for more. So where do I need this army? You're coming here, so this seems to be the logical choice. Okay, UK gets a core. So he's leaving. So let's put that core here for next time. USA is going to put drop this guy over here on a port. Okay. All right, we got a mechanized unit. Not sure where I should put this one. I'll put them here for now. Oh, and India gets core too. That's nice. <clears throat> the Indian core is going to go to Madras, I think. All right, so now all the units are out. Let's go back to China. I think we've done about what we can. We've got no money left to do anything. 14 can't let me upgrade anything. Although, might be able to upgrade an anti-air. For eight on a core. Or I can hold on to it. All right, <clears throat> these guys. Let's purchase. Oh, I can't purchase an anti air. It's over. So I can save the money and then get an artillery unit, which is probably what I'm going to do. Okay, so looking out at the world, do I have anybody in the water? I do not, except for this guy over here. He needs to come around. <coughs> so he can be useful. Can't let those pesky subs out, although they're going to be coming this way, which is actually my fear.
Let's go right here. And hold on for just a second. All right, I'm back, and I think that's going to be it. I'm going to hit the go button, and let's see what happens. No, I'm not really, but I'll do it. I wish I had more money. Don't really like any in turn. British morale is shaken. Sure it is. Germany celebrates the defeat of France. Um, it's the sink it in port. Some French battleships could end up in Sherman hands should they conquer Algeria or though Vichy would join the Allies. Uh, do we want to do this? Operation Catapult. Ensure that French ships never end up in Axis hands. Absolutely. <laughs> And French bombers attack. That's okay. Um, it is proposed that we launch an attack on Dakar in West Africa using Royal Marines and Free French units. Some of the gold reserves are held and the capture would be successful. If successful, General de Gaulle's prestige will increase and our own economic situation will be improved. However, it could trigger Vichy authorities to swing... Five to, do I want to do that? 20% chance of success. Either direction. Oh. Why not? Highland annexes gets, oh yeah, it's going to do that. Got that fortress complete, that's good news. Some rough seas, that's a bummer. Lost the battle, but not the war. Uh, they continue to vow to continue to fight. They signed the tripartite attack, and we have production technology one for the USSR. Very nice. Okay, so, supporting free friend. There's a lot of negative here, and we're going to have to get some of that back, but uh, hopefully next turn. You've been gaming with Colonel. Old Crow, it's your turn, and I am out.